Tomorrow, they'll celebrate Christmas, assuming that Christ is a God or a son of God. There is no greater lie than this. The greatest lie of all time. Christians have lost much of their basics and tenets of faith. The truth of Christianity was lost at its earliest stages of infancy. Another Nashville Islamic leader, Awad bin Hazim, is the Muslim chaplain at Vanderbilt University. He preaches contempt for Jews and Christians. Orthodox Islam teaches that Islam preceded Judaism and Christianity, and that Abraham, Moses, and Jesus were actually Muslims. When Muslims say they believe in the Injil, the Gospel, and they believe in the Torah, and they believe in the Psalms, they qualify. They believe that there has been a change in the text of the Torah and the Gospel. Therefore, originality was lost. Authenticity was lost. And Muslims regard this to be a deliberate change by corrupt priests of the time. They distorted the Word of God and eliminated the original Hebrew and Aramaic version of the Scriptures. The true evil today is the existence of one state. Aren't we this near for a mass battle and war against the Jews? Aren't they gathering themselves in Palestine? Imam Abdullah al-Ansari, an American-born Muslim trained in Saudi Arabia's radical schools. The Imam's sermons since arriving in Nashville have given further cause for concern. He told us to fight the Jews and Christians. Fight them until they give them jizya. They give this protective tax from their hands and they are humiliated and subdued. This country will not be the richest country on earth because it is the worst country on earth.